Good morning, muchachos. So it's 11 o'clock, and Iram is using the air fryer for the first time. He's gonna make chilequiles this morning for breakfast. So instead of actually frying the um, the tortillas, because he basically just buys like a package of corn tortillas and then he cuts them up so they look like this. Baby, didn't you do a video on how to make chilequiles? Yeah, I will put the link down below because he actually made a cooking tutorial on how to do this. But anyways, yeah, he makes them like this and then he fries them up. But he was like, hey, I should use the air fryer. So he's currently using the air fryer. It's our first time ever using it. And we will see, you know, I guess how, how well it works. I'm pretty excited. I think it's going to be pretty good. I hope so anyways. But um, anyways, yeah, it's got 11 minutes. No. Oh. It's just the set timer. Okay. I can smell them though. Like, I don't know. I'm excited. I hope it tastes really good. But anyways, we're just kind of having a low-key morning. I am currently getting my video up on the YouTubes. I'm almost done. It's up. I just need to do all like the verbiage mumbo jumbo and then make it live so that should be live i'm hoping within the hour so anyways once he's gonna pull those out of course i will show you guys because i'm really excited to see how they turn out oh wow yes those are definitely fried awesome so you're just gonna throw them in and that's it Yep. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Mm -hmm. Awesome. And there's the, the finished chips. Oh, I'm so excited. Hopefully they taste just as good, but I mean, honestly, when you throw all the salsa on it, it's going to be good. You just took a bite. How is it? Good? Mm -hmm. A little less time. A little burnt. A little burnt? Okay, less time. He put it in a couple of different times just to see, but it's still good. It's still edible. Once you pour the salsa all over it, it really won't matter, to be honest. But all right. Let me go back to the video. Vlog is live. Yes, finally got done. It's a short vlog, but hey, I got one up, so I'm happy about that. And the food is looking so good. However, Edam is saying to do the um, the tortilla, like the chips, and the air fryer takes a lot longer than frying them all up. Um, however, the cleanup is gonna be a lot easier. So I guess, you know, has kind of like its pros and cons, but here's what it's all looking like. So here's the chips so far. He's got some onions chopped up. Is that noise, the air fryer? Oh, so it makes like a noise. Yeah, it has a fan. Oh, it has a fan. I see. And this is our air fryer, the Kasori. I've shown you guys already, but I'll link it down below if you guys want to check it out or grab one yourself. Um, is this your last batch in here? Tomato. Oh, the tomatoes? Salsa everything. You're doing the salsa in here too? Holy cow. Oh my. Cool. All right. Well, I'm interested to see. Oh my God, that smells so good, the cilantro. Oh my gosh, I'm so hungry. I'm so excited for the chilequiles because, well, I love chilequiles, number one. And number two, I'm just really curious to see how it's going to turn out and taste. I'm sure it'll be good, but I'm just very, very curious. But yeah, it's definitely, I mean, typically if you would cook it the normal way, this kitchen would be all over the place. But um, yeah, it's not dirty at all. But all right, I'm going to heat up my coffee because, of course, you know, it got cold. And then just kind of chillax. Um, until it's eating time. All right, here's our breakfast, basically all made in the air fryer. How is it? You're already eating. Is it good? Do you think it's as good as how you normally do it? <laughs> it's the same? In the air fryer too? No. Oh, you didn't do that? Okay. All right, let's chow down then. It's a little bit later. It is currently 2.30 and we are hello bro oh trying to show that skin y'all um but yes we are headed to the big playground um typically we just go to the little one that's like right here but um this looks really bright but iram found a playground that's like what 15 minutes away from us and it looks massive from the pictures so we were like let's go check it out let the kids go play they've been dying to go to the playground but um the playground over here is gonna be like it's still muddy and like wet and dirty from all of the rain we've been getting. So this one is like, what's the word, turf? No. Yeah. yeah, turf. So we don't have to worry about mud, you know? So anyways, we're gonna first take out the trash because our trash guy hasn't came in like four days. One, tomorrow because they don't- Tomorrow's Easter. Yeah, tomorrow's Easter. So that's one. They usually come on Sundays, but they're not coming tomorrow because of Easter. They don't come Friday, Saturday, and they didn't come Thursday because of the thunderstorm. They didn't come Wednesday and Thursday because of the thunderstorms. So, anyway, yeah, gotta take that trash out. So we're gonna take the trash out and then go to the park and have some fun. All right, we're here, and oh my God, this place looks ginormous. Are you excited, Mama? That's gonna be so much fun, huh? And she's wearing her new Jessie hat, so cute. 
<laughs> Holy cow, like this is definitely as big as it looks and it still goes a little bit down and there's some stuff over here. And Alondra and Samuel already took off. I don't know where, oh there they are. They're gonna climb up there. Wow, good job daddy, high five. Still exhausted from that. And then before that, they were playing around and then we went and had like some snacks and stuff underneath a tree. It was really nice. And then the kids went to go play together. And then we got done having all the snacks, went to throw everything away, put everything in the car. We're looking for Alondra, Josie and I, and we can't find her. And I'm like, where is Alondra? It is a big park, but still, I'm like, where is she? She should be here. Samuel Santiago hadn't seen her, so I was like, what in the heck? So I'm like calling for her, calling for her, and then, you know, David is in the parking lot, literally look, looking in the car, trying to find her. Edom takes off looking for her, and he finds her where we were sitting underneath the tree. She was over there, and a bunch of ladies were with her, like, trying to find out where, you know, who she is, where her parents are, and then I just see, like, Edom from the distance, so, like, I run to him, because I see him with, like, a bunch of people, so I figured she was there, but I take off running to him, and there she was, of course, in the circle, and I'm just like, bawling my eyes out because I've never had a moment where I ever thought my child was lost, you know? And so that just kind of feeling just terrifies me, you know? Um, and so, I know, but Alondra was bawling her eyes out too, so whew, just had like two exhausting in instances in the park. Like definitely that one's obviously is more worse than her meltdown. I'll take her meltdown over potentially thinking she's lost any day, but. Oh yeah, Alondra went down the slide and she hit her elbow. She like, actually took a, like a little bit of skin off. She's not bleeding, but like, you know when you get like a burn type of thing, like a rug burn type of thing, like like that. So anyways, they had a blast though. So I'm really glad we found this place. It's really close to where we live. So it's definitely going to be a place we come to quite often, I think. But now we're gonna head home, freshen up. Um, 
it's 5 30 so we obviously we need to figure out what we're gonna do for dinner and i think we're just gonna chillax because like i said they're leaving at like two o'clock in the morning so anyways my battery is about to die so i will check in with you guys a little bit later dinner time of course we couldn't let these fools leave without some texas barbecue so we got some hard eight well, wait what did you guys get i don't know the difference between the meats what is this brisket and pork and that is, is sausage <laughs> yeah you know and then we got some french fries onion rings corn on the cob beans and oh, the mac and cheese oh my god that's the best mac and cheese ever oh y'all let's pass that over all right we are going to grub alondra's playing with her cousins one more time before they leave she's being a tickle monster i see you are you getting them are you getting <laughs> you getting your cousin? Aww. Get in here, y'all. Aww. Aww. Oh my god. Oh gosh, God bless. This is sad. I'm so sorry. We're leaving? I'm sorry. Not right now, a little bit. <laughs> Chachos and technically happy Easter, but I am going to end the vlog here because I forgot to end it yesterday. You want to come help me? Okay, come here. Good morning, Chachos. <laughs> Good morning, Chachos. All right, we're... happy Easter time, and I always open my pits. And... Yeah, but they're gonna see that tomorrow. They're gonna see the Easter baskets tomorrow. So you guys might get two vlogs tomorrow because I just realized today's Sunday. Well, you guys are gonna get lucky and just get an extra vlog or an extra video tomorrow. But anyways, we're gonna go ahead and end the vlog here. That way I can get to the video up for you guys. So I hope you guys, hey, helper, we're right here. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and just end the vlog here. So I hope you guys did enjoy today's vlog. Please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye Thanks bye. for watching. Bye bye, bye. Chachos.